the true miracle is the Quran. The Quran is true miracle? Yep. Okay, you speak that's, Arabic. That's the biggest miracle. Okay, you speak Arabic, right? That's the biggest miracle. All right, this is the biggest miracle. Let us see how big it is. Where hell is coming from, Ahmed? It is better than any other where, miracles. Where hell, where hell coming from? Hell? Where hell coming from? Hell. Uh, I have no idea. You don't know where hell coming from? It's not in. It's it's it's, it's in a different dimension. You don't know where hell came from. You never heard where hell came from. No. Uh, what is your education, Ahmad? I'm not a scholar. I know, I know. But did you go to school? Like, do you have high school? Do you have a degree? Anything? Yes, I I finished it. I, I got my my bachelor degrees. You have a bachelor degree, but you do not know how the hell is made. He, like you mean hell or hell, or hell, hell, the... like the ice, the ice from the sky, hell. Oh! Sorry, sorry. I thought you meant heaven and hell. No, sorry, no, I not hell. Hell, hell. hell. Yeah, hell. Hell. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Right. Yeah. Okay. So where hell okay. is coming from? Uh, it's from the sky, from the clouds. Okay. Is it true there is mountains in the sky and Allah He break hell from it? If uh, is it true what? There is mountains flying in the sky, mountain of ice, and Allah break from them hell. Uh, no. Hmm. What if I show you that this is what it says? You speak Arabic, you have no excuse. This is chapter 24, verse number 43. And remember, you are the one who says to hold me. Hold on, hold on, hold on. The Quran chapter is in 20, Hold on, chapter 24, verse 43. 43. All right, what's wrong with that chapter? What's wrong with that particular it says, verse? It says, It says, he sent down from the sky from mountains in it from hell to hit with it where the hell coming from from the mountains which is in the sky it's a metaphor for heaven it's a metaphor oh hold on where is the word metaphor metaphor for what it says jibal jibal is a metaphor now jibal mean mountains yeah i know but the mountain is a metaphor for heaven okay uh, how you know it's a metaphor how you can confirm it's a metaphor? I, I have no problem how you can confirm it's a metaphor well, I'm, I'm reading it and I'll, and I'll explain it to you because I think do you, you have... what, do you do you like to read the, the tafsir all right uh, okay yeah, pull up the tafsir okay here we go what tafsir you like don't tell me Ibn Kathir please Ibn Kathir is good for me it's good for you are you sure yep Oh, well, I, I wanted to show you other one, but uh, sadly you chose Ibn Kathir, which I don't like really, but I will go to Ibn Kathir. But remember, you are the one who chose it now. Chapter 24, verse number 43. Just like how the Bible has metaphors and and and. Okay, okay. Life, uh, well, stuff you know, like that my, my friend so you're telling me you're, so, you're telling me the bible doesn't have metaphors my friend just wait you said you accept you, you, you said you, you said you said you said you accept ibn kathir correct yes all right everybody heard you this is your wish read with me it says here from men this is men in arabic and uh of men ice means there are mountains of hell in the sky which Allah sent down ice. And you said to me, you accept Ibn Kathir. And I told you, please don't ask me for Ibn Kathir. Please don't. You said, no, Ibn Kathir is good for me. I said, please don't. You said, no, no, Ibn Kathir is good for me. I said, I don't like Ibn Kathir. You said, no, Ibn Kathir is good for me. So this is Ibn Kathir is saying, that mean there are mountains of hell in heaven you see it mean there are mountains of hell in the sky which allah he sent down ice from it so why you said to me it's a metaphor when the fact look, it's not this is ibn kathir this is your friend ibn kathir yeah i know but look I if you continue reading uh, Ibn Kathir, he agrees with me. As for those who say that mountains here is used as metaphor or uh, cloud. Uh, it's, no, it says here 
as for those who say that oh, yeah. mountain here is used for metaphor, they think that the second men is also you to describe, but he's saying they are wrong. <laughs> he's saying there's some they say that, but they are wrong. He is giving you the meaning. The meaning is, no, he sent eyes from mountains in heaven. But those who say it's a metaphor, well, they are wrong. And Allah knows best. And the Arabic is so clear. And you speak Arabic. So Muslim, they try to fix it. They make it more blind. We can open Al-Qurtubi. We can open a Jalalain. Okay, open Jalalain. Okay, that's so why Jalalain now is better than Ibn Kathir. Not better, but uh, he may have a, a different opinion. All right, let us see. Okay, read here we go. This is a Jalalain, and this one you said, okay, open a Jalalain. It says, He sent down from the heaven out of mountains, min jibalin, min extra, therein. So he sent what? He sent from the sky, from out of the mountain, out of the mountain. Do you see it? Let me zoom in. You see it? So he is confirming the same. So Allah he sent down out of mountains, he sent hail. He sent hail and he submit at the one he don't like. All right, no problem. What do you mean no problem? You have to leave Islam problem. now. You just told me that I'm going to copy this down. I'm going to copy this down and I'll give it to him. What do you mean you want to copy this one? It's in front of you. Ahmad, you be honest oh, with yeah. me. You know, I either mean, either this is coming from God or this is coming from a scam. What kind of God he says uh, such a thing? What if I give you the biggest proof of Islam? What is that? Okay, let me just... Don't tell me yet, don't tell me yet. People, he will give me the biggest, biggest, biggest proof of Islam. Are you ready? Please invite more people. The biggest proof of Islam. Ahmad, go. We are waiting. We are excited. Yeah, you, you you're gonna be excited because. All right. The, all right. Let me tell you. One of the biggest reasons mm. is the scientific miracles. Like what we are showing you now is this a scientific miracle? <laughs> is it, this is science now. He sent down hail from mountains, and you are saying to me that the biggest proof of Islam to be from God is scientific miracle. What kind of God he think there's a flying mountains in the heaven and he break eyes from them? <laughs> okay, give me a scientific miracle, my friend. Go ahead. That's no problem. That's look, listen, you, you gotta read it. It's it's you can't pick uh, pick it out of out of context. I'm you not I mean? I'm not I'm reading your Islamic interpretation. This is not me. This I'm, I'm just reading your Islamic interpretation. I did not say anything. In the front of me in the screen, it says, he sent down from heaven out of mountains. It's not me who is saying that. He sent down hail, and he submit this hail into the one he don't like. Very simple. So what do you mean I'm taking things out? This is what, this is what it says. No problem. What do you mean no problem? What do you mean no, no problem? problem? My friend, hold on. Well, you keep saying to me no problem. And a second ago, you said to me the biggest proof of Islam is the scientific miracles. And then this is, this, isn't it this is science? Isn't it this is science? It could be a metaphor. What metaphor? It could be, it could, what, okay. could be a metaphor. Let me ask you, as long as we are talking about uh, uh, storms, okay, is is the thunder, is the sun, thunder, the lighting, is it electricity? Electricity. Yeah. Yeah, it is. Okay. Your Quran says it's an angel. Show me proof. Chapter 13, verse number 13. And don't tell me I'm taking it out of context. Here we go. The, the thunder, this is an angel who is in charge of the cloud, driving them while constantly proclaiming he prays Allah. Do yeah. you see it? Yes, that is true. That is the unseen. Can you see the what unseen? What do you mean the unseen? Can you, can you see? James? So now you agree. You a second ago, I asked you, "What is the thunder?" You said lighting. Now you agree, it's an angel. No, 
I agree with both because this is the unseen. What do you mean you agree with both? How he is an angel and he is a lighting. I ask you, is he electricity? You said, is it electricity? You said yes. But in your religion, the thunder, Mr. Thunder is an angel. He is in charge of the cloud. He has 70,000 angels in his right side and he has 70,000 angels in the left side. So when he moved his, and they asked the prophet, what about the fire we see? He said, his, this is his fire built. He beat the cloud with it. Yes, that is true. Nothing is wrong with that. I That's agree. That's true. My friend, you just approved to us that Islam is scientific. Thank you very much. <laughs> but this is the unseen. You can't see the unseen. Can but unseen. See? This is something we see, Abdul. Come on. The thunder is something we see. Stop seeing unseen. We see, we see the lighting. We see the we see the lighting. We see the lighting. And the lighting is not an angel. Yep. I know. We hmm. can see the lightning coming down and stuff. And uh -huh. striking down, uh -huh. but we can't see how how it's happening. We can't oof, see the oof, 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 oof. yeah. Oof, 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 so oof, a second yes. ago you said to me the biggest proof of the Quran that is a scientific miracle, and now and I ask you what is the thunder and the lightning? You said it's electricity, and now the second we show you the Quran saying it's an angel, suddenly you just said it's yeah, it's true, it's true, it's true. Okay, what? Okay, do women have a sperm? See how I got you busted and you want to change conversation? Exactly. Okay. Oh, no. okay. Okay. <laughs> See, guys, Ahmad, you got me busted. <laughs> That's a good one, Ahmad. You know, oh boy. Ahmad, Ahmad, people will die laughing listening at this conversation later. I, I hope your kids one day will grow and you make them watch this video and they will die laughing. Yeah, for sure. I'm gonna download this video. Yeah, and promise me. I want you to promise me. You will post it everywhere. Do you promise me? Yeah, I'll post it on Islamic forums. Do you promise me to pro to post it uh, not only Islamic forum, like you know, like famous ones, Zakarnaik? What do you think about Zakarnaik? Uh, I uh, I don't really like him. Why you don't like him? He's handsome. And, uh, he's now I like the um, Arab scholars. What like like who Arab scholar? Name one for me. I never heard of oh. Arab scholar. Like who? Oh, you want to name you one? Uh, Mufti Mink. Mufti Mink is an Arab scholar. This guy is from South Africa. Yeah, he's South Af. He, he was born in South Af Africa. Uh, okay, he's so Arab. He's, he's an Arab. Oh, okay. Oh uh, right. yeah. Okay, so what what about you do this? What about you go to Mifti Mink and ask him if he dare to call me and debate me? He will he will destroy you in at in the speed of light. Listen, if he destroys you. No, no, hold on. Don't tell me speed of light. In the speed of the angel, Mr. Thunder. <laughs> what, yeah, but that's, okay, that's, that's as long unseen. okay, hold on, hold on. As long he Don't can, you believe in demons? You Muslim, but the demon is not lighting. But I don't have to do with lighting. And you Muslim don't have be, they believe in demon. You don't have demon. You believe in genie. And genie sleep with your women. It's not genie. It's jinn. Genie, genie in English. Genie, genie in the bar. You keep saying genie. Like okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. As long as we mention genie, is it true that your prophet he was a bunch of people? They ride your prophet. Astaghfirullah. What if I show you the reference? There is no proof. You're gonna what if I show you the proof, proof in the front of everybody? What if I show you the proof right now that a bunch of naked men, they were naked, totally naked, wearing no clothing, they were riding your prophet all day long, one after one, and stop to the point your prophet, he could not move at the end of the day. We do not know what they were doing when they are, they are in the top of him, but we go by the hadith. The hadith says they were riding him. They rode him. And you say, Astaghfirullah. I say to you, what if I show you the proof? Astaghfirullah. Okay, I'm asking you, do you like me to show you the proof? You said to me you are a Hanbali, correct? Yeah. Well, here we go. This is Ibn Hanbal, your master. You follow him. Musnad al-Imam Ahmad, Ahmad ibn Hanbal. And you are a Hanbali, which means you are one of his followers. Volume number one, page number 399. The hadith is in the screen. It says here, read carefully. <laughs> okay, he says, 
كما قال عفان إن شاء الله ليس عليهم ثياب ولا أرى سؤاتهم طوالا قليل لحمهم قالوا فأت فأتوا فجعلوا يركبون رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم وقال وجعل النبي صلى الله عليه وسلم يقرأ عليهم قال وجعلوا يأتوني فيخيلون ويميلون حولي and then he says continue فارتعبت منهم رعبا شديدا فقال فجلست أو كما قال قال فلما انشق عامود الصبح جعلوا يذهبون وكان وجاء رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم ثقيلا وجعا أو يكاد أن يكون وجعا مما ركبوه what they did to him they rode your prophet all day long and they are naked men you said to me أعوذ بالله and you said to me you are a humbly and this is your master Ahmad ibn Hanbal what say you and I, I will post the link for everybody in the chat you can use Google translation you speak in Arabic you do not need translation here we go you speak Arabic you have no excuse They did rode your prophet like a donkey all day long. And we do not know what does that mean exactly. I mean, rode him what? They raved him? Until he cannot even move and he have a lot of pain. They keep doing that all day, all night, into the morning. Let me check something. And this is the hadith in English. We are using Google Translation. Muhammad, he came, you know, Muhammad at the end of the day. He was, uh, you know, he was so much in pain because of how much they rode him until the morning. Never stopped, and they were naked men, wearing nothing. They don't have a cloth on. They are tall. They have little flesh. They are skinny, very tall. They began to ride the message of Allah all day all night until the morning i guess this is scientific miracle <clears throat> he hang up <laughs> Up. We guys, uh, ladies and gentlemen, we will have a funeral house open between nine to eleven. Please send your flowers. Our brother Ahmed, he have a heart attack. He could not believe that his prophet been rode by a bunch of naked men. <laughs> 